Hey guys, welcome back to my series on Save the Cat Writes a Novel. Today we are tackling the last beat in Act 1, which is the debate. If you missed the last videos in Act 1, I will leave the playlist in the description box below for you guys to check out. Let's jump right into today's video. So what is the debate? The debate is that moment in the novel where you are gonna show your character's resistance to change. As we discussed in the last video, you just wrote this big catalyst moment, this moment where your character has to change, life can no longer be as it was, and now they are debating all the things. The first thing you need to know about the debate is that this is a reaction scene. This is where your character is going to go, what do I do now? Should I go? Should I stay? Whatever the question is, you are going to show them questioning how they should move forward. The next thing you need to know is why they are debating this moment. And that is because, as you know, we all resist change to some point. We don't just uh, things don't just happen to us and we're like, okay, well, I guess that's what it is. We debate it. We fight it, we debate, our, we debate our options, we ask, what now, what next, do I have to really do this, do I really have to accept this change, can I get out of this change that's just happened to me, and if not, which is exactly what you need to do in your catalyst moment, you have to create a moment where there's like a point of no return. Otherwise, as I discussed in the last video, your catalyst is not big enough. So make sure that you create a catalyst that your character all the debating they're doing, it's not a matter of whether they're going to change because they have to, because you've made it so, but how are they going to go about this change? The next thing you need to know about the debate is that it is a multi-scene beat. So you're gonna create a bunch of different scenes where you're going to show your character resisting this change. They are going to fight it, they are going to do everything they can to not have to go through this change that you've created but at the end they have to go with it the fun part is going to be on how they embark on this change um hence your story so before we get into the last thing you need to know about the debate i want to let you know that on top of all these videos that i am creating about the beats in save the cat writes a novel i also have other videos that i've created on outlining using save the cat and i will leave those videos also linked below for you guys to check out because you guys, as you know, I love this book. And as I mentioned in the last um, video I did, this is not a sponsored video. I'm not getting paid to do this. I just love the book that much and I want to share it with you guys because I think, like I've said before, it's the best book I'm writing I've ever read. So now let's jump into the last thing you need to know about the debate. The debate doesn't always have to be a decision of whether or not they are going. The example that the author gives in Save the Cat Writes a Novel is like in Harry Potter, it is not a matter of whether or not he's going. We know he is going to Hogwarts. However, it's a matter of whether or not he's ready. So whether your debate is, am I going or not, or am I ready? The whole point is to get your character ready for the story, ready to embark on the next part of their journey, which is the story that you have planned out for them. Make sure you go back and watch the other videos that I did so that you are on track and up to date with all the beats. Also, if you are interested in buying the book, I have it linked below for you guys so that you can follow along as I am doing this. I hope this was helpful. Once again, remember to subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you get notified when I upload my next video, which is going to be every other day for the rest of November. And then I just announced in my newsletter if you're not signed up to my newsletter make sure that you're signed up but i did announce in my newsletter that i am planning on doing vlogmas this year i am so excited i've been wanting to do vlogmas for so long ever since i started youtube but i it was never like the right time but now i am and i'm really excited to share that part of my life with you guys and if you guys are into christmas videos and just vlogging stuff then make sure you are definitely subscribed and that you also get uh hit that notification bell so that you get notified you guys there's like something <laughs> i'm gonna show you guys what's in my window i don't know what the heck this is <laughs>
I don't know what that is. I'm gonna go handle that. Until next time, stay safe.